So the privilege of going to the Grand Canyon for the first time in my life. Have you been? I had never been. It's amazing. <laughs> and I will never forget, we camped on the Northern Rim and then we went down into the canyon and rafted on the Colorado River, spent the night on the riverbanks for a night and then rafted out. And I will never forget our guide explaining to us as, as we're surrounded by these canyon walls that the canyon walls tell a story and really it's a story of disaster upon disaster upon disaster. A flood, a volcano, a mudslide, an earthquake. And I just remember being struck that it felt like such a picture of what is happening in our world, in our country, in our hearts right now. We know what it is to be broken, to have our hearts split wide open like a canyon, but there in the middle of all of that division, of all of that pain, of all of that brokenness, a river was running through to bring refreshment, to bring hope, to bring new life. I'll never forget uh, when we went to sleep that night, our guide explained to us that, that we should not miss this thing that he calls the rim effect. He said, you know, in, in actuality, you will be further away from the stars than you've ever been in your whole life. You are miles under the surface of the earth. So it is dark down here. But because it is so dark, the stars will shine brighter than you have ever seen in your whole life. And I will never forget waking up in the middle of the night and feeling like those stars were right here in my face. And I just thought that, that is the love of God that can meet us, that shines all the brighter when we are in our darkest nights of the soul. So my hope is that this record would be like, like the stars that shine in the night, that it would remind people who feel weary and wounded and too broken beyond repair, that there is a current of love that will meet them in those places. There are ever present underground reservoirs of peace and love that we can access at any moment. And I am so grateful for the hope that our brokenness is never the end of the story because God sent his son to be broken for us so that we could know that the suffering that we experience, that the brokenness that we carry in our lives never has the final word. We are broken and we are beloved. And there is no darkness that is too dark for light to break through. Canyon is a record about the ever-present current of God's love that runs through our deepest sorrow and our deepest ache and that will carry us when it feels like we can't carry on.